It's another day and another GeoGuessr challenge. I'm going to actually try the daily challenge today versus making my own. Uh, I'll tell you why, because they added in a high score. So you can see not only the high score of like the top 25 or whatever, but you can actually see in the total of the people that played where your place is. So it's kind of exciting. It adds some more, add, add some more competition, add some more interest to it. So we'll try out the daily challenge for the day. These ones are the classic three minutes per round with moving. Um, I'll try not to take too much time on these for your sake, but looks to be we're in, let's see, I'm going to speak too quickly here, too quickly. Let's see if we got a, we do have a domain name, all right, RS, which is not Russia, right? Yeah, so you see on the, the signs here, they have Ulika, right, Ulika? Um, and this is a, uh, what do you call it, a Slav language, but it's not actually, I thought it was Serbia for a second. I thought RS was Serbia. I guess that's just, just the domain name then. Um, could it be, well, no, I, I think that's, it's still okay because we have, yeah, okay. So what is the, we have the language there where Serbian often um, puts up bilingual signs, so you'll have, uh, the Cyrillic and then the Serbian, Serbian in the Latin script. Um, okay, so I have a little bit more time here. Let's go ahead and see if we can find maybe a town entrance sign at some point. Oh, here's a highway sign. Let's take a look at this. And, ah, okay, so 127 to Verbas. See if that's a relatively large city. Oh, there it is. Okay, so take the 127 to there, um, which means we're over here somewhere. Unless Palenka. Where's that secondary, secondary city? I'm also looking for the road number two. So we have the seven, the seven and then the 127, 125, 129. Hmm, I don't see it. I see 126, not 127. Um, Yeah, not too far off. It's in Novi Sad. Novi Sad. Okay. I still don't even see that road number. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Next round. Next round. No entry. Driving on the right side of the road. We also have no front plates. I believe this is Puerto Rico. Um, do we try to 5K Puerto Rico? I might. It's very tempting. There's some skyscrapers to the south. To the south, eh? So we actually near ponds here? Might be. Might be. I have to keep I have to remember not to put my marker down because then I can't do the super zoom without plonking accidentally. So I need to get back into the rhythm of doing moving games. I've done no move in my weeks of refreshing. Well, that the back of the truck is going to confirm just the phone number, or actually it doesn't even have the area code, so not super helpful there, but this is, if we can get out of the suburb, we'll be doing good. <laughs> Try to get out of it, but then I found the end of the coverage there on both sides. 880, what did that say? That was a, yeah, highway sign number. Um... 830, 
Well, it looks like it's going to be around San Juan anyway, right? Because there's no like 800s. Yeah, there's no 800 number highways down there uh, in your ponds. So 862, 861, 840, 868, 889. Yeah, it's probably just one of the smaller, smaller roads in there. I think I'm close enough. I'm not, not going to try to 5k. Oh, nice. Well, that was nice anyway. Cool. Yeah, so it must have been... I'm not sure. I'm not sure where that highway was. Oh, it might be this one. Just labeled as an avenue there. All right, next. Next, next, next. I always... I, I see these things and I always think like, oh yeah, Bulgaria, right? Because the, the trash bins. Uh, but we do have the black dot in Argentina. Those are the signs here. Um, okay, so oh, let's keep on going here. Let's see if we can get to a main road. Find some more information. Now, are we just in Buenos? Buenos Aires, perhaps. Uh, let's go actually this way. There's a found. Oh, there's a historical monument over here. Let's see if that has any information for us. Oh, if I can get over there. All right, you who know your history, you know where we are already, right? You know the statue. I do not. So I'm gonna see if I can find a plaque on it. And, oh, we have something here. Oh, <laughs> it's a Netflix advertisement. That's not super helpful. Oh, and then there's dedication to the statue, although that's probably not going to help because I still won't know, even if I see the name of it. I don't even know if that's what language that is. <laughs> it probably is Spanish, but I just can't see it. I can't make it out in the stone here. Okay. Move it on. Oh, there's a perhaps somewhat useful sign. Let's see. Oh yeah, Buenos Aires. Okay, just just guess that. It's just the, the daily geoguesser challenge. It's gonna be Buenos, right? Um, probably just towards the center. I mean, we have skyscrapers around us. Okay, cool. Next one. Ooh. Do we actually have a beautiful location here? I think we do. I think this might be South Korea. Um, we do have black car, the dead of winter coverage. I don't know, even if I find a highway sign, I don't know that I'm going to be able to do much with it. Plus we're in the middle of a field, so it's going to take me a while to get there. So I'm just going to kind of look around, see if I can see any mountains. Um, it's pretty flat. It's pretty flat. Let's see, flat areas of <laughs> flat areas of South Korea. On the map, it looks like they're a little hard to come by. I'm just gonna guess like over here, or like maybe yeah, that's fine. Just somewhere there. Oh, just click soul. That's fine. <laughs> All right, last one here. Ooh, ooh, this car. This car is this a Uganda? No. I was going to say Uganda National Park, but that doesn't seem right. Is it a Kenyan National Park? These poles are like screaming um, Sri Lanka to me, but I think it's not quite right. It's like the really bulky insulators. Uh, oh, it is a park. Okay, so I think this is... So, Park Lodge... Hippo Hill Camp. Nice. Um, I think it's the Uganda one. Is this the Uganda car? I want to say that it is. Are we actually... Wait. Are we actually... Oh, we're driving left. Okay, so maybe Kenya? Oh, wait. Uganda drives left too, don't they? 
Yeah, we're on the we're on this side. Okay. So in Jovo, in Jovo Park. Okay, well this looks like the area that it would be in if it were here. And maybe this isn't like the park name, it's just the park lodge name? I don't know. Um guess I'm gonna go Uganda. Let's see. Nice, okay, cool. Was that okay, so was it the yeah, it's not even the park name, it's just like the name of the camp inside the park. So wasn't gonna find that. Um alright, cool. Gold medal, nice, twenty-four thousand. Sweet. Sweet, not bad. Okay, so let's see. First of all, let's look at the breakdown. The South Korea round, unfortunately, was actually the the worst one uh, for me. But all right, all right. Let's see. Uh, if we go back to, I got to get back to the daily challenge list here. Oh, oh, it says it right there. I finished sixteenth out of two sixty five in the top five percent. Well, this has just started. The day just flipped over for Sweden, I think. So. Not many people have um, have done it yet, but right now we are in 16th place in the world. Feels good, feels good, but you know, plenty of people will get 25K, I'm sure. So anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Try it out for yourself. Have a good day, peace.